Today in Review This Thing, we're going to review this thing. The Core Cases VRS Gun Case Insert. This is Robbie. And this is Adrian with Review This Thing. You've seen us shoot all kinds of videos with different rifles and shotguns. Every time we do that, we have to load everything up in a gun case and carry it back and forth. A couple years ago, we bought an Apache case from Harbor Freight, and we plucked out the insert to perfectly fit our brand new Bagara Ridge rifles. Well, that worked great until Adrian switched it up and started shooting that CBA Cascade a lot. The downside to that pluck apart is that there's no guarantee that your next gun is going to fit in there as good as that first gun. That case has basically been sitting in the back of our garage for a little over a year and we hadn't even used it. So if you had a similar situation with a gun case that has pretty much become obsolete, you're going to want to watch this review. Let's review this thing. As you know, we're going to tell you the facts. So let's start with fit. There are currently two sizes of core VRS inserts. The 3S, which is basically the medium, and the 5R, which is the large. We have the 5R, which is 50 inches long, 13 and a half inches wide, and three and a half inches thick, and weighs about 5.6 pounds. On their website, they have a list of cases that this insert will fit, but if your case isn't listed, just measure and you should be able to tell. They do say on their website, if the case isn't listed, they can't guarantee an absolute good fit, but we have the Apache 9800 and it fits perfect. They do have a 10 day return policy, so you can always send it back if you need to. We aren't gonna drag this point out. If the measurements fit, then it's gonna fit in your case. So we're gonna give fit a five out of five. Now is the core VRS case insert as advertised. The main thing core cases advertises about the VRS or vacuum rigidizing structure system is that it retrofits existing cases to create a customizable and secure storage solution, which keeps you from needing multiple cases. Those pick apart or even custom foam inserts are really cool if you don't ever plan on putting something different in that case. If you don't want to buy multiple cases or multiple inserts, then you're kind of stuck, but not any longer. We took that foam insert out of that Apache case and this core insert fit perfectly. You smooth out all the beads whenever there's air in it. You put your gun and whatever else you want to keep secure, smush it in there so it has a nice bit of structure around it. Take the pump, vacuum out the air, and I like to, as I go, smush it in a little bit more just to make sure it's nice and settled. Vacuum out as much air as you can until you see the actual beads kind of that are visible and you can see those ridges and it's hard. I have been told that the more air you get out, the longer it will stay in that conforming shape. This pump isn't going to allow you to pump out too much. So don't be afraid to pump a bunch of air out. When you're finished, just take this, slide that button, pull off the pump, and you're ready. You can see here there's a clear imprint of the gun, and if I try to move it left, right, up, and down, it's not going anywhere. And the best part is you can do this for whatever setup you want. So if we're taking two guns, we just pump some air back into it, put those guns in there, repeat the process that Adrian was talking about, pump the air out, and we've got a good solid case for two guns. Or you can put your gun, ammo, hearing protection, and spot and scope in there, suck all the air out, and it's gonna keep it secure and protected. So now if Adrian decides to change guns again, we can still use that case and this insert. This insert took a case that we spent $150 on and never used anymore and turned it into the case that we use all the time now. So for as advertised, we're gonna give it a five out of five. Next up, construction and durability. First off, CORE is an American company that supports wildlife, veterans, and safe firearm instruction for kids. So that makes it pretty awesome in our book. Now, as far as the insert, the exterior is made from mil-spec fabric. That sounds cool and all, but I did a little research that actually means this fabric is resistant to heat, flame, and freezing temperatures. It also means it's been physically tested for strength, durability, and being abrasion resistant. It's even puncture resistant and tear resistant. According to CORE, if you can drag a sharp object across your hand and not cut you, then it should not cut this fabric. But if something should happen, let's say you forget to close your knife or you drop something in there and you do puncture it, it actually comes with a patch and instructions how to easily repair it. The fabric also has antibacterial and antifungal properties, is non-corrosive and prevents rust. It won't hold oil, moisture, or solvents. So your gun is not only protected because of the conforming and rigid structure, but also because of the fabric itself. Plus, if the material should get dirty, you can easily wipe it down because it won't hold moisture. We didn't intentionally try to damage it, but we have used it quite frequently and we haven't had any trouble. 
As we've already said, the inside is filled with tiny little beads. So it not only is gonna conform around your firearm or whatever you're trying to protect, each bead has its own vibration and impact absorption qualities. So instead of being surrounded by a piece of foam, it's surrounded by thousands of pieces of foam. So it should be even more secure when it's traveling or transporting or if you should accidentally drop it. Now I do wanna talk about a couple questions that we have. One thing that we experienced over time, some air seemed to get in. We had taken the gun out about two weeks earlier and it is still firm, but it's not quite as firm as we started. What I was told from CORE is that the more air you pump out, then the longer it should last. They've had up to 45 days of it staying nice and almost like vacuum sealed. Moving forward, we would just take more air out. We weren't really sure how much to take out, but obviously, a little bit more than we did to start. They did say with major temperature changes or altitude changes, like with flying, you could have a little bit of air sneak in, but overall it should stay where your gun will be secure for up to 45 days. I think if we were gonna travel with it, I would probably take the pump. It doesn't take up that much room, it's not that heavy, and that way if you should accidentally get air in it, you could always just pump it out pretty quick. As far as durability, we've had it a couple of months now and have used it quite a bit, but we can't really speak to the long-term durability. In fact, I don't know that anyone can except CORE because it literally just came out this past January at SHOT Show. If you've had one since then and can speak to durability, please comment below and let us know what you think. They do have a one-year warranty, so that should add a little peace of mind also. Overall, we really enjoyed the design and construction of the CORE case insert, and we plan on using it a long time. So for construction and durability, we're gonna give it a five out of five. Now for testimonials and reviews. This product literally has only been out about six months, so it was really hard to find any reviews on it. We read through a few articles to see if we could find any complaints or problems, and we couldn't find any of those either. So we can't give you a score, and we can't tell you the complaints that people have, so for testimonials and reviews, we're gonna give it a four thumbs up. And finally, should you buy this thing? So I guess we can start by saying it does still kinda depend on what you're looking for. You can get one of those just kind of general foam cases. We've had one for quite a while. We've used it a lot. We still use it. They're usually less expensive if that's the route you want to go. But I can tell you from personal experience that those have held moisture when it comes to, you know, changing temperatures, condensation, things like that. You can also buy a custom insert for your gun. And I saw them anywhere from $125 up to $250, $300. The trick with that is if you have more than one gun or if you change an optic or add a suppressor or something like that, then you're gonna have to get a different insert. And now you have this other insert that's pretty much garbage. But if you have multiple firearms or you want the flexibility of changing optics or you wanna carry a bunch of different stuff, then this core cases insert is pretty awesome. The MSRP on this 5R is right at $300, but I did see it on Optics Planet for $275. That $275 is fairly comparable with those custom inserts, and you only need one of these. Okay. What we've experienced and what it's done for us, then it's been totally worth it. And we always like American companies that support the things we care about. So we're gonna give, should I buy this thing? A five out of five. Hey, thanks for watching our Core Cases BRS Foam Insert Replacement Review video. While you're here, watch a whole bunch of other videos, give them a thumbs up. Please make sure you check out reviewthisthingtv.com and sign up for our newsletter. And share this video, like it, comment, follow us on TikTok, Facebook, and on Instagram.